Guten Abend. Uh, I understood from Mechimano that some people have questions. Maybe. Ah, oh, mm -hmm. maybe. Okay. It's hard for me to concentrate. Yeah. Very difficult to concentrate. What do you mean when you say it's yeah. difficult for you to concentrate? It's very difficult to concentrate on the rising and falling. My my thinking and my thoughts are always going somewhere. Excellent. It means that you are practicing correct vipassana. I ask you something. If I go now to the mirror and I look to the mirror, okay. I can see my beautiful blonde hair. Oh, huh? what I see? You see your face. Ah. If I see in the mirror, can I see my blue eyes? <laughs> what color of eyes I see? My yeah. own color. You see, Vipassana is like a mirror. It was nice to see nature. You look outside, you see the moon. Big moon outside. Can you see? You see sunshine. <laughs> nature. And we are sitting here, we are listening. Very quiet birds. No, at all there is no car running outside. Huh? We are listening, we, see, we hear nature. We see, we see nature. It was nice to see nature. When you are why I told you that you are practicing correct to the point. Because now you tell me when I practice I see that I have many thinking. It means that you are telling me that when you was practicing you see some kind of your own nature. So I ask you something. Thinking is good or bad? Sometimes it's bad. Mm. Sometimes it's bad. Mm -hmm. So what do you mean? The same thinking change? Oh. Thinking is just a thinking. When you like them, you say, this is good. So where is the suffering? Is the suffering in the thinking or the suffering is the, it depends if you like it or you don't like it? Sometimes people, they are driving or whatever and someone making beep, beep, beep in the car. Yeah. To hear the beep, 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 is something nice or not nice? It's, it's okay. <laughs> just the hearing, yeah? If I'm driving, okay, and I try to be relaxed and someone making beep beep beep, maybe it's create anger on me. I don't like it. But if I'm sitting and waiting for my friend, why is my friend is not coming and suddenly beep beep beep, ah, he's coming. Actually, I just got information from the evening. See, in this case, I touch, I want it. In this case, I don't want it. And then I'm upside down, <laughs> suffering. That's why the Buddha say suffering is not because of outside, suffering is because of inside. One man, I saw it, uh, sometimes I tell this story, yeah? One man, he was, uh, this was story in Israel, uh, before I became a monk. I hear it, maybe, I don't know, in the news somehow. <laughs> he was waiting in the post office. And he was standing on the line. And then, the man, before then, he go to the office and talk with the, the man in the counter. He's just waiting, he's just waiting when he, he will finish the, the, the work, uh, the, what, the duty, what he's doing, changing money or whatever. So the man before them, he finished to talk with the counter, with the man in the counter, he turn and he start to go out. And then he see that this man that is starting to go out, he forgot about uh, 1,000, uh, let's say 1,000 euro on the counter. In Israel it's different money, okay, but I just for example, I uh, okay, yeah, yeah. know for sure this money belongs to this man, why I should give him back? I should tell him, be careful, you forgot your money. So he said, hey, mister, mister, sorry, you, you forgot your money. You please go to take your money. And what happened is that the man, they start to go out. He get anger. I don't know even why the reason. He take the knife, he said, why you get involved? And then he take the knife and kill the man. You see, even sometimes, we hear even good words. But if the anger coming up, anger is one thing, one example, okay? come up, control our mind, and then suffering is coming. That's why the Buddha, when he was sitting in the night, and he started to look at himself, he started to see the thinking. And he started to see that, not only that he have thinking, he also have anger against the thinking. Or maybe worry because of the thinking. Or maybe it create doubt on him. Or maybe laziness. Why I don't go to sleep? Why everybody sleeping and I have... Huh? Or maybe uh, greed coming up. Huh? 
and he fights with all these things of the night. Mm -hmm. the, the creature is suffering because in the mind there is a rubbish. There is, we call it kilesa, anger, worry, doubt, lazy, craving. This is all about hell. Actually, all the creatures are there. Even dogs, you know. Yeah. You have dog, you give them food, everything. You go for shopping, you come back, it's all oh, oh, so to bark on you. <laughs> what you want? I'm your owner. Why are you are barking from anger already? Actually, the, the Buddha, he find out that this is the reason we are suffering. Even something very, very clear, pain. Does anyone like the pain? Is anyone that likes the pain? Mostly people they don't like the pain. Nobody likes the pain. I ask you something. Pain is good or bad? For me it's not good. <laughs> I tell you something. One time, when I was, it was, I, even I was young at that time, when I saw this article in the, in the television. I remember that I saw it in the television. This is special hospital. You know how the room is built? Like balloon. Big, big balloon, huge balloon. And in every one of the balloon, one person. You know why this patient, they have to stay in the balloon? This patient has some kind of sickness. It is the fun. nerve defect, they cannot feel any pain. You know, if these people, they cut, they never know that they cut. There is no sign in the body, I cut. This is pain. You see, I do this, I feel pain immediately. I know how much should I push. If I don't know, I push maybe too much, I can break my hand. And you go, maybe the leg, pack, eat something. He even don't know that he eats something. If he cut and the blood come out, he will not know that the blood come out. He don't have any idea, because no feeling, no pain. That's why they have to protect them in the balloon. So nothing will hurt them. So you see how much the pain is important for us. See, the problem is not the pain. The pain show you how much anger you have inside. Oh, maybe something will happen to my leg. Already fear is coming. What so I, like? I can see by the pain how much fear I have inside. I have to see the pain. And, uh, when this sitting will finish, maybe I open the eyes to look. It's to show me how much impatience you have inside. <laughs> maybe it's good for me, maybe it's not good for me, maybe I make mistake, maybe... Ah, doubting already inside. How can you see all these things like a mirror so clear? When you acknowledge, for example, you see the pain, you acknowledge pain, pain, pain. You don't like, like it, acknowledge disliking, dis disliking. Huh? Ah, you feel afraid from the pain, acknowledge fear, fear, fear. Ah. Yeah. When you finish, why never finish? You see the uh, impatient, you acknowledge impatient, impatient, impatient. In this moment, something like the big tree of the anger, big tree of the greed, big tree. Every time you acknowledge, ping, 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 you cut one leaf, one leaf, one. you cannot cut in one time. No possible. But slowly, slowly we are cleaning. That's why the people say we are lucky. Because all the creatures, uh, the anger, worried out. But it's possible to clean it from the mind. And this is by mindfulness. Whenever you see the anger, you ignore the anger, you cut a little bit. You see the greed, you ignore it, you cut. You see the laziness, you cut. You see? Every time that you're mindful, everything that you are doing, ding, 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 slowly, slowly, you are cleaning the dust from the eyes. This is by product of the mindfulness, of the vipassana. Buddha call it the city. You know, very beginning when I start to practice meditation, even <coughs> five minutes I cannot see. And also I was, yeah, I, I was sickness, I, I had a sickness with the leg. With the leg. Yeah. And when I practice I develop more patience, more energy, more many, many things. And then I clean sickness from the leg. And people think well, they are coming to practice meditation, they come to sit and ah, I'm so shanty shanty, yeah, so nice, I'm not thinking about anything. So I fly on the hair. <laughs> it's not Vipassana. Vipassana is to learn to overcome the difficulties. And the uh, important thing is not the meditation. The important thing is when you finish the meditation and you go back home. When you go to the work and someone tells you something not nice, you can ignore it, hearing, 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 disliking, disliking. Then like you make it with a pain. And then, boom, ah, you build the confidence. She's asking for us, so also in the daily life, outside of the meditation, we are acknowledging? I ask you something. If you walk now down, if we finish this evening and you go down, and you start to look at the pictures or whatever, and you stop down, what, what is the possibility that you fell down? That you didn't step correctly on the stairs? Yeah. We should Very be high. mindful on the steps how we go down on the stairs. Yeah. You think people walking on the sidewalk, yeah? and then they look uh, 
What the possibility they stuck on something and they fell down? Fell. Not important for them to be after? Driving. <laughs> ah, maybe I read newspaper and I drive. <laughs> Possible? Or I have to be after for the, my driving? Even the policeman said to us, don't talk with the MD when you are driving. And mindfulness should be all the time. If people they don't ask them, you think in the work, in the company, they make some, I don't know, with the oil, with the machine, and they don't be concentrating. Very dangerous. Uh, even the football game, if they, they, in one moment they are not concentrating, they lose the, the ball. How, mo how many of them? I don't see, but I can tell you that many of them, they lose the game because they were not concentrating. Very important for the trainer to teach them to concentrate. Don't think what will be later. Now you are beating the ball. You have to win. If you ask me, actually the meditation is not important. <laughs> we don't need meditation. <laughs> but we need the life better. We need to be in the life better. Should I go to the gymnastic room to, to waste money there? Huh? I go there to make my muscles strong so I can live my life and my body will be healthy. We do many exercises, many training to improve our life. For example, there is some friends here that are teaching yoga. Same thing. The people go in, they train themselves, they feel happy, they go back home. So in this case, the walking and in, uh, in the sitting meditation is to develop the mindfulness. But the, the mindfulness in the daily life, this is the important. You see, sometimes we are doing many, many things. Not like the meditation, slowly, slowly. We are walking, we are even running to the bus or whatever. You don't have to say three times, okay? You can say even right, left, right, left. Ah. You can w one time moving, touching, turning, lowering. You don't have to do three times. But in the, w in the meditation we make three times, so we can uh, practice more. We can train ourselves more. Please, if you have more questions about the practice. Um. That's a problem in the walking meditation. You can speak German, okay? Let's match you with translate. If I'm holding the hands behind my back very quickly, I'm getting pain in the shoulders. What can I do? Can I hold the hands uh, in, in front? No, you can. But very important, when you do some movement, you have to acknowledge everything, okay? Before you move, mm -hmm. you acknowledge pain, 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 disliking, disliking. Let it beat you, let it teach you as much as is possible before you just change and then after you acknowledge and then moving, 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 touching and then you can continue but you have to make stop and stop and stop and stop ah. mm. no, because say we have to be middle way, no need to be too tough sometimes people sitting there, wow, so strong pain in the knees for example huh? would they teach us machima, middle way, don't be too lazy, not be too, too tough if you feel, if for example, you're sitting, you feel pain, you know, it's pain, 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 disliking, 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 eh? Mm -hmm. If you don't move for every small pain, but if you really, it's really unbearable pain, you cannot take it anymore, eh? Moving, 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 touching, stretching, 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 eh? You stretch your leg, when the pain a little bit relieves, then you can bring it back with mindfulness. Don't open the eyes and don't lay back. I use the words before, I say, no pain, no gain. The pain is like your teacher. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you, if you don't have pain, you don't get anything. You don't reach anything. Yeah, it's like a teacher. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I'm sitting in the class, the teacher wants to teach me so strong lesson. I cannot take it. <laughs> I don't run away from the school. Because if I open the eyes, I, I don't want to practice anymore. Something like I run away from the school. Something like I said to the teacher, one moment, moment, let me <laughs> breathe a little bit. So I open the legs. It's something like I go in a little bit from the class, resting a little bit and come back to the class again. When I shoot, come back again. <laughs> I cannot run away because after some time it will come back again the pain. So I try to learn again, to learn again, to learn again till I can overcome it. See how much is training you. In the future you need to go somewhere to wait. Okay? To wait for something, to get into the, I don't know, work or something. And you have to wait long time. Here you are building a patient again and again and again and again. You're building more and more patience. In the future you sit, no problem. I can wait long time. Ah. We train you how to be patient. For example, or effort. You, know, you think sometimes we are waiting, so why? This man is never go out? When he will go out? 
when yeah, happen to you sometimes you are waiting for something and you're looking at the time when will it come why it never come huh? this, is, this is patient so we are saying oh when this time I will open oh, why am I there look at the feeling <laughs> looking at the time huh? impatient so in this way we are being impatient I think you can play, no? <laughs> no? Ah, okay. Any, anything you said? Uh, you said that... Um, in the picture? Ah, 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 okay, okay, so please. Okay, I'm not to translate. Okay. You said that meditation is not so important. It's more important what you do in, uh, in your daily yes. life. Yes, yeah. But... Um, because I'm a beginner, yeah. I see that uh, some monks that have been practicing meditation for long, I'm sure that they practice uh, mindfulness uh, every uh, day, mm. daily life, uh, every moment, but they still, they still uh, practice meditation, so, mm. so it must be important. Eh? I asked you before what you are doing, huh? you say I'm sitting, this is already meditation. I'm talking to you, you pay attention to me, this is also meditation. You sit here, listen to me, you know, uh, uh, arising, falling, rising, falling, this is also meditation. Actually, whenever you pay attention, this is already meditation. What is the meaning of the word meditation? Meditation is a word in English, and the meaning is to think, to think about something. If I'm sitting here and thinking about my teacher in Thailand, I'm making meditation, I'm meditating on my teacher. This is in, in English, that's what they say, I'm meditating on my teacher. Thinking, what I'm going to do tomorrow? I can say I'm meditating on tomorrow. This is the meaning in English. But when this kind of thing, what we are practicing, come into the world, they use the word of meditation. So people think meditation is this one. Meditation is not this one. No. Actually, the Buddha even didn't use the word of meditation. He used the word of bhavana. And development. To develop the mind. When we talk about meditation in this case, okay, what, the, what we are practicing, we're, we are talking about to think about something special, about something, certain things, okay? Because you can think about anything, okay? To think about my mother, this is not the person <laughs> Okay, I, I Okay, I said when we, are t t when we are using the word meditation, in this case of what we are doing, we are talking about to think about special things, or certain, certain things, okay. When we are talking about Vipassana, I give example, I am sitting and I am thinking about my dear friend. This is meditation, but this is not Vipassana meditation. Now, if we talk about Vipassana, we talk about to think what I am doing, to remember what I am doing. Uh, and when I know, or when, when I pay attention, or when I know what I am doing, yeah, this is actually the meaning of what the Buddha teach Vipassana. I can walk to the bus and I can pay attention, I'm doing Vipassana. Because why? Because I pay attention, in this case on the sidewalk, on the way to the, uh, okay, uh, to the bus. So I'm making meditation on the way to the bus. So I'm practicing, I'm a monk sitting in the cave or walking in the cave, rest nach vorn, links nach vorn. Also then I'm making meditation, Vipassana. I'm a student in the class. I'm sitting and I'm listening to the teacher. I pay attention, now I'm listening to the teacher. I'm making vipassana in the class. Yeah, I'm making meditation. If other 50 friends sitting with me, they don't know that I'm practicing in this moment. I'm a very serious monk. I'm sitting in a cave in the snow and I'm looking, rising, falling. I'm also making the same things like the students. <laughs> so mindfulness can be any time during the day. And then it means that you are practicing with Even Absolutely. before sleeping. You know, you lay down, you know, laying, 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 you are touching the, the pillow, you know, touching, touching, you know, rising, falling, laying. You are practicing with Pasana, the same like this serious monk in the cave. Why before I said to her that the important is not the meditation but the life? Because I wanted to show that we should be mindful all the time. What we can be mindful? About what we can be mindful when I say I want to be mindful about myself? What happened to me that I can be mindful about? So first thing, like I say, sometimes I'm sitting, eh? sometimes I'm walking, sometimes I'm standing, sometimes I'm laying down. Eh? I have body, 
Yeah, I have big body, walking, sitting, standing and laying down. I should be mindful what I'm doing. Hmm? I also have, sometimes I'm touching, turning, rising, whatever, lowering, putting. I'm making many, many small movements, huh? Right, left, right, left, rising, falling. Yeah, so I have big body and I have small body. Huh? I also have feelings, huh? I'm happy, I disliking, I'm neutral. We have also feelings. Hmm. So we have body, we have feeling, but I'm thinking, what should I tell you? I mean, I have mind, thinking, huh? Uh, memories, planning. Yeah. So we should be mindful about it. And we have also mind objects, anger, worry, doubt, lazy, craving. We should be mindful for them also. Huh? For sure we have six sense doors, hearing, seeing, smelling, tasting, feeling, thinking, everything we should be mindful. But it's four foundation of mindfulness. Being four elements that I can pay attention to them and then I know what happened to me. Mm -hmm. Body, feeling, mind, mind up. You want to repeat together everybody, huh? Together. Body. Yeah. Everybody, no, no, I'm living here, everybody, huh? Body. Body. Gefühle. Geist. Geist. One more time. Körper. Gefühle. One more time. Wonderful. You understand? Any other thing? Things for the practice, difficulties, things not clear. Actually, today we wanted to to talk about uh, some kind of subject, but <laughs> I don't know if it's suitable already. Hmm. We also hmm. have to just to digest? get it digest, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah okay. okay. Mm -hmm. the what yeah. kind of topic would it have been? Who, who you wanted to talk about? Mm -hmm. You see, the Buddha uh, to be. Okay, now I'm teaching you, okay? I'm, uh, I teach you something that my teacher teach me. My teacher also, he said he didn't find it by himself. He have another teacher teach him. His teacher also say, I don't know myself, I, another teacher. I know four teachers for me, back, I know them. The fifth uh, the generation already, I don't know who it was. Maybe in the book I can find out. But I know four generations behind that come before me. But, but also he never said that he, he find out it. He said it was someone else to teach him. Mm -hmm. But we are learning from each other. We don't know by ourselves. Someone teach us the way, show us the way. But 2,553 uh, years ago it was someone that he find it by himself. His name was Siddhartha Gautama. Mm -hmm. He was a prince in India. And he find out this way, this technique. Mm -hmm. He found by himself how to clean the mind. In this way he can understand the nature better or in a clear way. And that's why they use the word of Buddha, understand. That's why they give it the title Buddha. The Something like the first professor. Uh, but this professor, this Buddha, he, nobody teach him. He could find it by himself. But it's not magic that someone sitting and can find Vipassana by himself. Am he I has to know something. He mm -hmm. has to develop something. It's not mean that he was uh, something like a god or something. Mm -hmm. He was a human being, but he has some kind of knowledge mm -hmm. that we don't have it. For example, Pele. Why Pele can do things that I cannot do? Because he well trained. He practiced it a lot. Eric Lapham can do other things. Mm -hmm. Because yeah. he, he practiced different things. So maybe the Buddha didn't know to play guitar or to play football but they have some kind of quality that give them the understanding mm -hmm. how to clean the mind. So the same things like uh, Pelé and uh, Eric Lepton, they just tra practice again mm -hmm. and again and again. That's why they have the ability yeah. to do what they can do. So the Buddha also, he practice again and again and again many things that give him the ability to find the person. Mm -hmm. It's not enough one thing, you see, for Pelé, he know how to play the ball on the head, how to play the ball here, how to he know many, many things. And so, so we develop many kind of techniques that help them to be good mm -hmm. football player. Even Eric Clapton, he don't know only to play guitar. He can sing, he can write a song, he can mm -hmm. make a... He, he has the melody. He developed many, many things, many qualities that give him the ability to do what he's doing. So for the book, if we talk about to be Buddha, we, there, it's mentioned about ten qualities that you need 
Mm -hmm. So you can be, you can find the vipassana without teacher. Mm -hmm. We call it faculty. Uh, something that you know to do. It's faculties, okay? Without Every me. person has different faculties. Yeah, in Pali we call it parami. Mm -hmm. Or parami. Mm -hmm. And the Buddha has ten, uh, ten parami. So because we don't have, uh, you're already tired and uh, I'm not going to go into each of them or whatever. I just mention them fastly, okay? Yeah, but I don't make mistake with this uh, order. I will, uh, I will in look that in the book. And the, the first one is the giving. The, the ability to give. Mm -hmm. You know how to give. It's called dana. Okay? And there is different because uh, there is books about the Buddha, the history of the Buddha. So one of the books, it's about six books together. They talk about the past life of the Buddha. And finally the words of uh, birth, it means jati. Okay, and that's why they call it Jataka. It's about, uh, because you remember how many stories? 1,500 or I don't remember, I, uh, not, I don't know, maybe 500 stories or maybe more. I think 500, you remember how many stories in Jataka? About many, many stories about the past life of the Buddha, mm -hmm. how we develop the quality. So there is a story how we develop the ability to give, 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 what we call dana. So this is the first one from the ten that we mentioned. The, the second is sila. Sila it means the precept. The monk has 227 precepts. Uh, the third is uh, nekama, it means uh, renunciation. To let go, to release things from you. The fourth one is panya, is wisdom, knowledge, to know things. Uh, and then next one is viriya, it means effort. And then can, can, uh, the next one is kanti. Kanti is uh, uh, patience, how long I can wait, okay? For example, we don't have much patience, no, not enough kanti. We open the eyes to look at the time when it will go and finish. Huh? But we have a lot of candy, a lot of patience. Then comes Satcha. Satcha is right speech. It's not non, uh, not only I'm not telling lies. Right speech, many many ways. Yeah. Yeah, there's many ways of, uh, for example, when you say the things correctly, not too much and not too uh, uh, too less. Okay. You promise and you make it. You don't uh, promise and you don't care after this. Then you say the right things on the right time, okay? to gossip, not to tell bad about people. There are many, many deep meaning for such a right speech. And then the next thing is Atitana, determination. Yeah, I want to do something, I try to do, I can catch it. Yeah. And then uh, come... Meta. Uh, Meta. Meta, Meta, loving kindness. Okay, you remember? Upeka. Upeka, it means neutral. I speak bad to you, you say neutral, mm -hmm. you don't need to say anything. People say about you things which is not correct, mm -hmm. not the right, you say neutral, you don't let them learn by themselves. So, actually, this is the ten uh, perfections that I call true. This is the ten perfections of the Buddha. Mm -hmm. There's many stories that talk about how when the Buddha was this and this, when the, uh, what. Uh, up and now we develop it. So in the very beginning I, uh, I thought to, to talk about this subject, but, but many things, many things to talk about. <laughs> Interesting, many things. Okay, so thank you very much. Good enough.